NBPA chief Michelle Roberts told our Ramona Shelburne players overwhelmingly want to return to play. ESPN's Adrian Wojnarowski has reported the NBA is in talks with Disney to resume at Disney's Wide World of Sports. The format of play, of course, has yet to be worked out. But catch this from Damian Lillard. Here's what he told Yahoo Sports today. He said, quote, if we come back and they're just like, we're adding a few games to finish the regular season and they're throwing us out there for meaningless games and we don't have a true opportunity to get into the playoffs, I'm going to be with my team because I'm part of the team. But I'm not going to be participating. I'm telling you that right now, you can put that expletive in there. And so, Max, let's start with you on this one. How does that make Lillard look as you hear this context and how he feels about this? Smart, competitive, and justified. The threshold for games where the local TV money kicks in is 70. The Portland Trail Blazers have played 67 games. They're three and a half games back. So they're supposed to be three and a half games back with 15 games to play. But instead, they're three and a half games back with three games to play, no playoffs. I believe that's what he's worried about, and he's right. What he's saying is, oh, everyone wants to get paid, right? But so you want to technically complete the regular season, then we got eliminated. But no, we didn't get eliminated. We have 15 games, plenty of time to make up three and a half. And now you're telling us we're already out. No, I'm not going to play under those circumstances. Dominique, I get that. He's like, all right, y'all want to play, go straight to the playoffs, play some playing games, fine, we have a chance. But if you're going to say that the regular season was finished and we don't have a chance when, in fact, we did, it's not fair. He's right. Yeah. For him, it's not fair. Yeah, I, I don't disagree with anything he said. The only part that I would disagree with is, why is he even going? Like, it seems like part of the risk of going there in during this pandemic is you have to travel, and that exposes your, you to more danger in being in that bubble, as safe as we want to believe the bubble is. Somebody's going to step out and someone's going to come in. That exposes him to some other risks. So I understand. I appreciate him wanting to be a part of his team. And as long as he understands the financial implications of not finishing these games, whether they are on him or or, or not, I assume the games will go on whether he plays or not, which means they reach that 70-game threshold, which means that their money is not impacted as much as you think. As long as he understands that, I appreciate that he's coming out and saying this publicly because I've been on plenty of teams where guys who didn't want to play and all of a sudden they got a bad knee or they got a bad back or they're a little sore, they find a way around it. He stood up and said, print that expletive and said exactly what he meant, and I respect it because he's right. Why would you want to go be a part of something that you feel like is a sham and short changes you the opportunity that you worked for. Portland is lucky to have him. Damian Lillard did not look for greener pastures. He's not trying to do the thing where everyone teams like he's trying to win there. Yeah. He's going to go out swinging. That goes for this season too. You got to admire that guy. That's a franchise player. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.